Hello students. Today we are going to learn about three auxiliary verbs which are am, is and are. So what is today's topic? Auxiliary verbs. Today's topic is auxiliary verbs. Let's listen a story about three brothers. Once upon a time, there were three brothers lived in a home called Am, Is and Are. The elder brother's name was Am. What is the elder brother's name? Am. Though they were brothers, they had different behaviors and different nature. Elder brother name is Am and he was very shy person. He had only one friend. His best friend name I. What is the best friend's name? I. So Am likes to hang around with I. Only with I. He will play with only I. Let's make a sentence with Am and I. Like I am a boy. Let's see this picture. What is this picture? This is a baby. So if this baby talks, what he will say? I am a baby. I am a baby. So am will go with I. girl she looks like sad so she will say I am sad what this girl say I am sad look at that I will go with am am and I are best friends am has only one friend that is I I am sad let's see one more picture Who is this? This is a farmer. The farmer will talk about himself. I am a farmer. I am a farmer. Am will go with I. The elder brother's name is Am and Am always go with I. This is the story of the elder brother. Now let's see about the second brother. This second brother's name is. He called is. Is has a different nature. Is has many friends, but he always hang around with singular persons or singular objects or singular animals. That means if he even though he has many friends, he will play with only one person or one animal or one object. This is the nature of is. Look at this one. What is this? This is a table. How many tables are here? Only one. So is hang around with only one object or one person or one animal. So here we can make a sentence with is. This is a table. A table. See? Is will go with only one object. This is a table. Let's put this sentence over there. This is a table. Let's see another picture. Who is this? This is a doctor. So, how can we make a sentence? See, he is a doctor. He, he is only one person, not two or three. He is only one person. So, is will go with singular. That means one person, one animal or one object. He is a doctor. Let's see another picture. What is this? This is a truck. How many trucks are there? 
only one we can make a sentence this is a truck a truck only one truck so is is going with one object singular object that means is has a great bonding with all singular objects now let's see the third brother we, we said we there were three brothers yes now the third brother let's see who is the third brother the third brother is r what is his name r okay what is his behavior he is different than the other two brothers this third brother had many friends a lot of friends always he wants to hang around with a lot of friends that means a lot of uh, people a lot of animals or a lot, lot of objects okay a lot means plural objects plural people okay let's see a picture what is this these are eggs this is not one egg there are many eggs if it is plural we will add s and we will say these are eggs so what is the sentence we can make this eggs what's the color of this eggs white look at that eggs are white see because these are plural many if there are many we will add are we cannot say is is will go with singular object these are plural many so eggs are white let's see another picture what are these these are crayons we will not say this is crayons look at that this is plural if we add s those are plurals see r goes with plural objects r goes with plural objects or plural animals we can see one more example see this picture what are these children doing the children are painting how many children are there three children four okay see if there is only one child we will say the child is but there are many the plural is children so children are painting see the sentence they are painting there are many that's why we put are hope you had fun and understand this three brothers story who are these three brothers am is and are now you know the word am is used with only i and the word is is used with all singular objects or persons or animals and the word are is used with all plural objects thank you